Tonight, the Cedar Rapids Titans kick off their preseason. One of the big questions, would the storm keep fans away from the football game? Brian Scott is live at the Cedar Rapids Ice Arena right now with more on the folks who are braving this weather. Right, Brian? Well, that's right, Jack. We're just outside the stable right now, and if you're a Minnesota Vikings fan like me, you're used to a dome over your head. This isn't really ideal football weather. Very slushy, very cold, very snowy out here tonight. But that didn't stop all the fans out here from coming out and welcoming their new Cedar Rapids Titans home. A hot crowd and some arena football action is all it takes. To forget about the sloppy mess outside. Titans fans came from near Lamar Marion area and far They're down from Urbana yep. to see their new team play despite the sloppy weather outside. A little slippery at parts, but not, nothing unmanageable. Wasn't that bad though. It wasn't just a little slick. As far as driving, it was actually really good because the interstate was good, but we left early. That's definitely necessary. While the snow isn't piling up as high as originally thought, it is coming in heavy and wet altering the driving plan for many on this night. A little slower than normal probably, actually driving the speed limit. For those staying inside, there's going to be a mess when you finally step out. That includes these fans who say they were ready for anything to get here. As long as people drive like they know it's snowing, it's fine. To scrape the windows at the end of the night, is it you or... Uh... Probably me. <laughs> And you can see as a lot of the fans are leaving behind me, people are going a little bit slower than normal and taking it easy. The roads are still pretty slushy out here and pretty slick as a result. So definitely if you are hanging out tonight, keep that in mind. Now as for the big game in to inside tonight, the big preseason game, unfortunately I am going to spoil it for you. It was a loss. Mitch Fick, Jared Aarons are all going to get into that a little bit more tonight in sports coming up a little bit later in the show. Covering the corridor in Cedar Rapids tonight, Brian Scott, CBS 2 News.